What is going on everyone? Tenai here and today we heard that there's a weird achievement that we can get from Simulator Universe World 6. And while we're at it, I thought it would be nice for me to do a little mini showcase for my Sila. And I will tell you what we have so far after getting to Trailblaze level 44. We literally used all our fuels and all the powers to farm for Sili, and we were able to achieve something great. We right now have 81% crit rate, 131% critical damage, which is moderate. Have you seen those built Sili? And I don't know how they're so lucky, but somebody told me that someone has 70% crit rate with 170% critical damage. That would be insane. Insane Sealy right there. It would be nice for me to actually borrow that Sealy, do a showcase. But this is E0 Sealy with her best in slot light cone in the night. We get 18% free crit rate. And then, you know, you get the bonus for every speed you have, whatever. But we're not using Asta in the team, so we're not getting the maximum damage bonus from here. Hence the reason why I said this is a mini showcase. We were able to get super lucky with the relics. I'm very happy about it because that means we are all set for other DPS showcases as well. So right now, we have a godly feat that has crit rate, critical damage. So in Star Rail, the max number for crit rate, critical damage is actually lower than those of Genshin Impact. So if you multiply crit rate by 2 and add it to critical damage and if you have like 30 something that means it's like 40 cv equivalent in genshin impact and then we have attack feet it is better for you to go for attack because Celie gets a speed bonus after she uses her e her chest looks like shit I mean, her chest is great, but her chest looks like shit. Her body looks like shit, but this is okay. We have a uh, crit rate, okay? If I somehow be able to replace this later, I will definitely do that. Hands looks like shit. That's why I didn't level this. I'm still waiting for good hands. For the heads, we have 28 CV, which is pretty great. Um, For the spear, I only have 5.8% critical rate here. And then for the rope, we have 34% critical damage, which made me wanted to do this mini showcase. Adalons, we have E0, because I know that if you showcase anything with Adalon, that means you're dumb, so I have to, you know, prove to you guys that you can still do this with E0. And yes, again, this shit, I can probably replace it with another free-to-play 5-star hunt you can get from the Hurtas shop and still be able to show the same thing. Let's go ahead and do that. So, this is my team right now, but I would definitely want to replace Tingyun with Asta, because Asta gives you speed buff, and that would allow me to get the full bonus from my Sealy's uh, Light Cone, but right now, I think it's okay. And because we don't have cleanse here, we're kind of screwed. It would be better if if I replace Bailu with my Natasha, but you know, I like Bailu. She heals a lot. All right, are you guys ready to see this silly showcase and a way to get the little stupid achievement? We're gonna go crazy with the hunt bonus. These birds, I can one shot. Oh, oh, that's the dream damage, man. 5k auto, very nice. So, similar universe. We all know, but this is a brain dead content. We chose hunt path, right? So we choose the hunt all the time. It's good if you have a main single target DPS and it's too good. You get a lot of turns back and you do so much damage and the bonus here is just crazy. Ooh, okay. All right, we have the speed increasing by 30% until they are attacked. Guys, it's easy. Just don't get attacked and you will keep on having that speed bonus. If you're using DOT damage characters, then I don't like you. <laughs> I, I like main DPS, okay? I should have used my OT. Let's do that. Okay, so I'm very, very worried and excited at the same time because I need to kill Kokolia without killing Bronya. And that should only be possible if you are very strong. And I feel like my Zili is strong enough to do that. Die. We kill the ball. Nice. Oh, restore HP. I don't think that's good. Hunt, hunt. After character uses ultimate, they gain a shield that absorbs damage equal to... Oh, dude, this is going to be very good. When we like get infinite turns with my Sealy in the future. Oh, okay, okay, guys. We've got the fat boy right here. Yes. He looks like me. We do this. Oh, 40k damage already. Okay. Maximum damage bonus. So the battle is over. Mm. Okay. I'm very satisfied by her damage. Let me reset the hunt. No! Uh, I want to reset once again. 
Our showcase is over, guys. Fighting spirit. Cool. Fortune glue. Do we have enough? No. No. <laughs> I have money. Please take it. Please take my money for power. <laughs> Let me refresh this. Okay, what does Herta have for us? Should we get one star rarity blessing or upgrade? I get one star. We got the hunt. Hmm. Extra turn. One star is good. Okay. Oh. What floor of similar universe should I grind for relic? EXP. Six. Forty six K now. Hunt, hunt. After character is healed, their speed is increased by ten percent for one turn. Ooh. I like. Should I start using fuel to farm World 6 Relic? Yes, if you can, go for it. <laughs> Infinite turns! Oh! Yes! Do we want occurrence or combat? Combat. Oh! A ball. They're so weak. I'll hit the big guy. Best path for the world six? It's whatever is good for the built characters of yours. Nope. Reset. Crit damage, nice, I'll take that. Okay, what's this? What what's this? Oh. Oh. Forty six K. Look at this. Look, look. Oh, how much damage was that? Sixty five K. I see. Freezing point. What is he going to do? Oh, ouch. Ouch. That hurts. What is this real damage? This is not real damage. What are you talking about? This is F2P damage. Lucky F2P damage. If you can get to TL40. Oh no. I'm going for the hunt. Oh. Oh yes, we finally got a robe of the beauty. Oh, beauty, yes. Yes, beauty. Uh, do we want Curio again? You know what? Let's go. Curio. Destructible objects will appear more frequently and rewards obtained from them are doubled. Ooh. I'm gonna get this. We get more damage bonus for every destructible object that has been destroyed. Okay. Perfect showcase. Okay, do this. Maximum damage bonus! Did I use my E before? I think I have. Oh, 90k! Oh, very sad. Oh my god, my E did like 30k damage, dude. When struck with a killing blow, instead of becoming downed, characters immediately restore. Oh, dude! I'll take this. Destruction! Wait, what? Transaction. Occurrence. I don't need transaction. Oh, it's a yellow ball. Can I kill this? I think we can. Okay, let's kill it. This thing will die first. Hmm. Oh. What? More damage. That's dead. This is also dead. Oh my god, silly, stop! When a character provides healing to allies, increases the attack of both units 50% for one turn? I'll take that. Oh, wait, what's this? When a character defeats an enemy, restores their HP equal to 48% of their max AP. Nope, I'm taking this. Break, you get extra turn. The hunt. More hunts. Okay, good. Guys, this is it. This is it. So, the condition to get the achievement here is to kill Kokolia without killing Bronya. So, that's gonna be a little weird. Okay, here we go. We start. Okay. This is not the maximum buff. 
that we can give. Oh. Oh, that's so... That's so close. Let's do this. Heal everyone. 50% attack bonus. And this should... Kill her. 69k. A little disappointed, but I guess it is what it is. Oh, we broke her. Yeah. Hello, Bronya. I'm gonna just ignore you. Okay, do this. Give the buff. Skill. And then use my ultimate. Oh, 114k! We finally entered the third phase! Oh, dude, that's very satisfying. Please don't die. Please don't die. This is your highlight. Oh my god, Bronya, please don't die. <gasps> they all froze. Extra turn! Stop! Oh my god. Okay, okay. If we can kill her, we don't need to try again. We're not gonna die, okay? Alright, please, please, crit. I mean, it's gonna crit, right? Obviously. <laughs> we got the achievement! Hey, yo! Oh my god, dude. Oh my god. E0. Okay, none of them are actually enabled. Light Cone, S1, Tingyun with like shit HP, Bailu with shit HP, Bronya with shit relics. So, yeah. If you work on your DPS, you can do that. I only started farming for like a couple of days. So yeah, I think Hoyoverse is telling me to do a lot of showcase and show all the potentials for characters. And yes, Inert Sal Soto seems like the best relic to go for. So if you can farm in World 6 before TL40, you should definitely farm. If you can cheese it with Sampo or whatever characters, you should definitely do it. Because I farmed for World 6 after being able to, you know, farm for my Sealy because she was a single target DPS. And without good artifacts, raw damage of those DPS single carries are really bad. So yeah. Oh my god. Can't believe I actually did it. Oh, save the princess. Oh, this is actually a gold achievement. It gives you 20 jades. Defeat Kokolia without defeating Bronya. Oh, save the princess. Ah! <laughs> oh my god. I can't believe we did it. This is not the way achievement anymore. We can do it after we get TL40.